Welcome back, guys, to the Mr. Perfect run of Mega Man The Wily Wars for the Sega Genesis. Now that we've destroyed the three Genesis unit members, it's now time to take on the Wily Tower itself. As far as your weapons are concerned, make sure that you have the Thunder Beam, the Ice Slasher, and a few good utility items in there. But throughout the first stage of the Wily Tower, you'll pretty much just be using Thunder Beam and Ice Slasher. Throughout this first stage, you'll see enemies from Mega Man 1. Throughout the second stage, you'll see Mega Man 2 enemies. And throughout the third stage, you'll see Mega Man 3 enemies. So they kind of ordered it out like that. Throughout the first part of this stage, you'll have quite a few enemies that will die in just one hit to the Thunder Beam, so stick to that. Just keep on moving, climb up this ladder over here and get the Ice Slasher ready because we have a big eye up here as well as some fire sticks from Fireman stage. You'll eventually come up to a path split. If you brought crash bombs with you, then you can take the path split. However, I'd recommend just taking the normal path. I think that it's easier myself. Just continue to take out the enemies as you go through here. Go over here, climb up this ladder, shoot a thunder beam, slide with it, take that enemy out, and then keep on moving. Up here is an area kind of like Elect Man stage for Mega Man 1. You got gab yalls moving around on the floors, and you got uh, electric traps here and there. This area doesn't last too long before you come into an area that's like Fireman stage with the little fire traps and everything. Just wait for the right opportunity and slide underneath them. Or if you brought Rush Coil, Item 1, Magnum Beam, or whatever, you can skip the traps entirely. Throughout this area, you got little Gutsman like traps. If you brought Rush Jet or Item 2 or something like that, then you can just fly right over them. Down here we got another area that's a lot like Fireman Stage. You got the chain keys coming out of the lava and everything and more fire sticks. Just wait for this fire stick to go down, then we'll move on. Alright, down here we'll have more fire traps as well as other Mega Man 1 enemies. Just wait for the flames to get out of your way, then slide. Just keep on doing that. And yet again, down here on this area we have another fire trap. I think that this is the last screen with the fire traps, though. Down here on this screen, if you want, you can just call Rush Jet or use Item 2 or something to uh, get over this area. Just fly right over here to the right, and you'll be at the boss's lair. I'd recommend using Ice Slasher on this boss. The boss of this stage is a dragon, similar to the one that you fight in Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link. But only this one has more attacks than the dragon in Zelda 2 had. It'll come up on either sides of the lava. The further you are to the edge of the spring, the higher up you'll bounce. Shoot it in the face with Ice Slasher. It has three attacks. Whenever it comes out of the lava, it will either shoot a steady stream of fireballs, which will be very, very easy to avoid if you just stay away from it. After it's finished that attack, it'll go into the lava, dive up and out, and fireballs will come out. You can't hurt it while it's doing that, so just avoid him and the fireballs. Then he'll come back up on either side of the lava and start doing one of two attacks again. Either shoot a steady stream of fireballs or he'll shoot fireballs directly at you. Whenever he decides to shoot the fireballs directly at you, they're a lot more difficult to dodge than the stream of fire, but still not too bad. But he'll just keep on repeating that until he's dead. Overall, a pretty easy boss, but a fun one. I like fighting on that spring. But whatever the case, that is it for Wily Tower Stage 1.